Vlog Lab Normality. So as you've probably guessed by now, I am one of the new members of the club. So you've met me and you'll be meeting the other one tomorrow. Exciting stuff. So as you've already seen, my name is Sophie Hall and my main channel is called Sophie Hall because I'm just that creative. I will be putting a link to that in the box below. I would appreciate it if you went and checked that out and watched some of the videos because then you could get to know me a bit better and see what kind of crazy person I am. So I have the Tuesday spot that Liam previously had. I hope I can live up to his standards. So the theme this week is to do a hair tutorial. So I will be doing that. I haven't done anything to my hair. This is completely natural, which is probably why I look a bit of a mess at the moment. But that's so I can show you what I do. Enjoy. Okay, so I've moved into the bathroom, as you can tell by the change of acoustics. And I'm in a t-shirt that I don't mind ruining because it's a messy process. As you've probably guessed, I actually dye my hair quite a lot. Like, I had blue hair not that long ago. And all that dyeing and straightening, it really damages your hair. So I'm going to show you what I do to keep it moisturised and feeling nice. It's easier to put the products you're going to be using in a tinting bowl. And yeah, I have the tinting brush, but you're not going to need to use that. So don't worry if you don't have that, you can just use a normal bowl. So the first thing you're going to want to do is to... I'm sorry, I don't have my contacts in, so I don't really... I can't really read the bottles, I don't really know what I'm applying. But I'll show you what I'm using so you know the names. Um, I think, yes, I think this is the one. Yeah, I can't really read it, but this is what I put in my hair to keep it moisturised. You're going to take your bowl and you're going to pretty much just put the whole tube into this bowl. Like so. So as you can see, I have put the contents of the tube in this bowl. Start applying straight away. Just rub it into the worst parts of your hair that are really dry. Just sort of rub it in a bit. You're gonna want to get your roots as well. Because even though your roots aren't that damaged, you don't want to leave them out. It's, you can have some fun with it, you can like, stick your hair up. Don't worry if you don't get your whole head because you're just going to want to get the best bits really. So just rub that in. Like so. You see it's like the hair's already looking smoother. It's a good. Good sign. Remember to do the back of your head. A lot of people forget and then they have very damaged backs of heads. This stuff does smell quite a bit but it's bearable. Just get that bottle, or the tube that I showed you before, just get it and apply it to your head. Just like, try and apply it to most of the top of your head. Because that's the most fun. So I've used the entire tube. I don't remember the tube being that small. So you just leave that in your hair for about 5 minutes, maybe 10, and then you just shower it out. I'm going to go shower now and remove this and I'll show you how much smoother my hair is afterwards. Okay. So if you want to go bald, you should do that. But you know I'm just kidding. So I'll see you next week. Bye.